CRISPR Babies World's First Genetically Modified Babies Do crispr babies exist? The Most Controversial Human Experiment Genome Editing in Human Babies? Have you ever heard about this? Can you ever believe this? No, it's impossible. Like you, we were also shocked when we found this out in 2018. It was most sensational news at that time. If you have heard about crispr babies, you might already know who He Jin Kue is? If not we will know him today and also find out how he produced crispr babies. He helped parents with HIV infection to give birth to healthy HIV infection-free twins. This video is prepared for educational information only. He Jin Kue is a professor at the Southern University of Science and Technology in China. On November 26, 2018, Jin Kue announced the birth of twins Lulu and Nana. And by doing this he not only surprised the world but also surprised himself by later receiving a three-year sentence to prison for his work. Wait, prison sentence for conducting experiments? But why? At a genome editing conference in Hong Kong, Dr. Jin Kue claimed the use of CRISPR technology in human embryos. He edited human gene CCR5 in those embryos and gave birth to twin girls whose were Lulu and Nana. So, why the CCR5 gene? And what does this gene do? CCR5 gene is responsible for helping the HIV virus or infection. CRISPR-mediated gene surgery or gene editing was done to knock out the function of CCR5 gene during fertilization. Mother Grace's egg was fertilized with Father Mark's sperm cell. And Father Mark was HIV infected, they could never have healthy babies. But, with IVF and CRISPR technology, they had healthy twin daughters. So, what is the difference? Isn't this normal IVF? Why is there an ethical issue? During this experiment, CRISPR guide and Cas protein were used to edit the CCR5 gene when Lulu and Nana were at single cell stage. The genome of the human was modified by using CRISPR technology, which is considered both illegal and unethical. Whole genome sequencing was done to know if the gene was modified or not. Then, the embryos were transferred to Grace's womb and the delivery of the babies was normal. Again, after birth, Deep whole genome sequencing was done to verify no gene other than CCR5 was edited. And babies are healthy and HIV disease-free. This is the story of first genome edited babies. Please let us know your views and what you think about genome editing human babies through comments. Is this ethical or unethical and why? See you next week in the another video with a new interesting topic.